new skills. But boy, you in the danger room. Yeah, you in the danger room. Come on now. <laughs> it's like a dream. Everything moving fast, but you moving slow. Change the tempo, watch, we on time. Hey, now you know. Listen to the rhythm, we giving them, we bringing it with passion. Smashing. Welcome back, y'all, to another race. This is Daily Race B at Lake Megora. Full course, five laps, group three. We're on racing hard tires, too. I managed to get the pole with a 159.375. We're going to start out with traction on three because I'm going to try to jump out there and get away from them here, hopefully. Don't want to get passed by a sweaty chop. Sweaty chop. What a name. But anyway, here we go. We get a little greedy with the corner there. I had to try to, I was just trying to keep that half a second lead I have on them right at the moment. When I get to the end of it, that's when I brake before I get in that turn. But I kind of eased off the brake. I didn't. I trail brake about halfway in, then let out. I should have trail braked a little longer on that first lap. Kind of about lost it. <laughs> Even though we got a 1.3 gap on them, but they're battling P2, 3, and 4, battling pretty hard back there right now. It's all in the replay. I didn't get to see none of it. I'm maintaining just to try to get a gap on them. We're up 1.4 now, basically. I get to watching P8 down there. Uh, Mud Sniper 2. Now that player gets on the move here in a second. He's in P8, they're in P8 right now. Just keep an eye on them. They come up at board pretty quick here. I don't know where they started out at. They done jumped two spots already they have. Be easy on the fuel right there. That, that player's done up three spots in a quarter of a lap. So I don't know, I can't really take a Sunday drive. I gotta try to keep pushing the best safe laps I can put down. Just to try to maintain a gap. It would have been a race if that player would have qualified and would have been in the front of the pack. That would have, this race would have been really, probably really good. <laughs> it was really good for me, I mean, I got good ratings out of it but I went back and watched the replay it's pretty awesome
get over here as far as the cannon and swoop in. We're up four seconds at the moment. Player done overtook another one up to P4 now. When I started this race, I, I seen P2's name, and I was like, I don't want to be passed by somebody called Sweaty Chop. So I pushed all I could to stay in front of that person. Why be getting passed by a Sweaty Chop? Woo wee. trying to run a comfortable lap here just trying to keep at around three seconds three to four second gap now we done the other section of this track about a month ago and then this one was pretty good on this full course I used the Porsche in the last race, it was on the other section too, and it done pretty good. I'm going to do another race, but I'm going to use a different car and see how it turns out. On both of the race B and C, which race C is at Watkins Glen, and you, you got to rent a tuned car, a special car for it, which they have like, I think, six, seven cars you can choose. a little bit. Got to be gentle through here. Ain't nobody pushing me so I can take my time. I won't catch no slowdowns or nothing. Really, I think you really got to do something really bad to get a slowdown on here. Though. I think it's basically car connect with another player because I know I've jumped to the corners a couple different times unless they're just really weak on the penalty as far as that goes I found fourth gear done pretty good there as long as you babysat it into there and then get hard on the gas once the car was planted to hook straight without the weaving and swerving part. I always go to that little black spot on the fence there and that's where I start breaking at. Almost at the 50. deeper in there and they won't penalize you. I just try to keep it within two tires but on the right side of the white line anyway. It's a little wild getting over that grass but to make a good swoop through there you gotta get over as far as you can. Alright. That player's in P3 now. And got the fast lap. He almost put down the lap I did for qualifying.
still trying to race a little smarter through here. We got a decent gap. All I got to do is run a good, decent, safe lap and push in areas that I know I can push hard in. I have behind me are fast. P2 and P3. P2 was going to give me a run for my money if, if P3 and 4 didn't put, him under, put them under attack at the beginning of the first lap. That's the only reason I got a decent lead on them. Just kept a safe lap down, y'all. We're coming up to the finish line. And we'll go through the previews of the replay. There's a few action-packed moments, but mostly it's just some good, honest, clean, hard racing here, y'all. We're in C-class now, huh? Got the pole position and clean race. That's good. Prize money to 50%. All right, here's a preview how it went. Yen's judge it out, Kim's on two, there you go. 